this is a bottle of ink. Be careful as you open it. Here's my dip pen. Notice that it has a metal point. It's called a dip pen because in order to use it, you have to dip it partially into the ink. You draw by touching the wetted pen tip to the paper and dragging towards you. By varying the pressure of the tip, you can also change how thick or thin the line is. When you shade using parallel lines, it is called patching. To make your shading darker, go back over your lines in a process we call cross-hatching. Here I am creating the illusion of a shadow by using parallel lines. I'm hatching. Another shading technique is to add dots. This is called stippling. And you can always combine shading techniques to create different looks and effects. Remember to dip the pen partway into the ink. To make lines, touch it to the paper and pull towards you. And then use parallel lines to create shading.